tutorial we're going to be designing this exact flyer sorry this one with our canva so unlike pixel lab canva is an app that uses internet so you can either download the app from play store or you can use the web version of canva i love using the web version so the first thing you need to do is open your browser type canva.com you're going to arrive at a page like this you can either sign up here for free or you can log in if you already have an account so you can sign up either with your google with your facebook or with your email so i'm going to be logging in to, i'm going to be logging in with my google so continue with google so i'm going to be using this my account and uh, after that it's going to bring me to my canva page so the issue is that they use network or like pixel lab i can design without internet so and they have pre-designed template that you can use but in our own case we're going to be starting new design from scratch click on this plus icon so for social media click on custom size we are going to be using 1080 by 1080 pixel create new design so this is what your page will look like so ignore this ignore this by clicking here so they are trying to suggest templates to you in case you may need to use either uh, any of these templates so in our own case we don't want to use any template we want to start our design from scratch click on that top space so the next thing to do is to choose your background click on this white space click on color so we don't have we don't have this color the background color here so we can click on this plus we can input our color by ourselves let's use 001 001 Four four nine. So this is our design. So once you are done, just click on this white space. That's where your design is. So the next thing to do is to start importing our elements. So in personal elements you can let's create the circle bit below so click on that plus icon don't forget if you want to add anything to your design you click on this plus icon so i hope you've watched the introduction into introduction to canva so once you've watched the video you'll be able to know all these tools so click on plus icon we want to use elements so either is element or you can upload from your computer if you want to put text so we are going to get there let's use elements we want to draw a circle so you see it under lines and shapes so this is the circle or you can use the recently used anyone so we're going to increase our circle size so one thing about canva is that they give you this you can see this kind of this type of line so what is telling you that your your element is at the middle is aligned at the center of the page so if you are trying to align your design you can use the help of this to know where your design is so that's that the next thing is to choose color we're going to be clicking clicking on the plus icon which color we're going to use let's use 
FFE is one E. It's one E. So click here. It's already there. So you can drag it up a little bit. So you can duplicate this shape by clicking on this plus icon. So duplicate. I'll actually duplicate more than enough so let's start again duplicate so it's duplicated let's change the color so let's change the color to f fc so you can write the colors the code so that you use it the exact color we use f f c six one Okay, so that's the second color so if you want to move your design or your elements a little bit you can use this notch so all right so that's that so the next thing is to import I think the two need to come up a little bit let's select our elements okay let's bring it up a little let's bring this up a little let's just come down a little nudge So the next thing is to import our burger. Click on this plus icon. Click on upload. Upload files. So we want to upload from device. So let's use our documents. I have the picture somewhere here. Yes. So this is my burger. Click on it so it will start uploading your design so unlike pixel lab that you can just import so this one you have to upload first then before you can import to your design so those are the disadvantages all right once it's finished uploading So you click on it and it will come to your design. So you can increase the size. So, and the beauty of this Canva as well is that you can lock your items so that it will not be moving. Let's log this. Okay. Let's let's log this. Okay, let's lock our background. Okay, let's log this first. We'll lock. So, so the next thing is to import other elements. Don't forget the process upload upload file from device documents. Let's go to gallery. So what are we okay? This background is flash. 
ok it will upload once it finish uploading So once it, once it's finished uploading, the next thing is to click on it. It will come to your design automatically. Let's increase the size. All right. So in this case, we are going to look for position. We are going to send it to back. So you can see that's that and that so you can lock down as well let's lock so what next is to import other elements don't forget the process so let's import this Let's import the social media stuff. So we imported the social media stuff. Increase the size. Increase the size. So I think we're good. Okay. So let's lock. So next upload. Device. Documents. Gallery. Food, what next? Okay, let me upload this. So let's click on it. So in this design you can see this particular one is is white let's see if we can change it to white if we cannot we can create it by ourselves let's see apply colors to okay it seems we cannot change the color if you cannot change the color then we use our own color so it seems you cannot you cannot change this color here so there's no option for changing the color what we can do is that You can actually create it by ourselves. Just go to plus icon, click on text, add new text. You also want to type X X X X x x so that's that we're just going to change the font font let's use advantages no 
know let's use this archival black all right this one is good let's increase the size so let's increase the size to 25 Let's use 30. Okay. Okay. It's a bit bigger. Let's use 20. Okay. Let's use 20. Let's change the color to white. to change the color to white so that's that so we can delete this where is it this Trying to remove this from there. Okay, let's just start from the text part. The color is white. So I will click to edit X, 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 X x x so let's reduce the size let's use 20 so Let's drag it up there. Alright, the next thing is to import the next elements. Actually, upload. Upload. Device. Document. Wow. 
Okay. We're going to upload. Upload it. Click on it. And start. So let's increase this size. So that's that. Don't forget to lock it. So the next thing is to upload the last resources from the device. This is the last one. Click on it. So let's log this. With this, we have achieved all our elements we have put them in place so the next thing is to start putting our text let's start from the so if you want to put text click on that plus icon then click on text so once you click on text you want to use anyone So let's type fresh and tasty. Fresh and uh, tasty. That's that. The next thing is to select the font. Font. So any fonts you see this crown beside that means it's a premium font you can use it if you are on a free fashion on a free fashion so we are using free fashion for now so let's use this one this is it john 3 or what is the font style so increase the size So, in the absence of no other fonts, we have to use this. Let's use 75. Let's choose the color. I'm going to be using this color. So I'm going to be using this color. I think it's a little bit bigger. Let's reduce the size to 65. So you can duplicate it by clicking on this plus icon. Bugger. So Boga
So I'm going to make the burger white. We are going to be making it bold. Okay, there's no option for bold. We are going to increase the size. Let me see if I can get another font. This font seems not really good. Let's look for another font. What about this? The same thing. These fonts are not really cool. So that's the only issue with Canva. Let's look at Lex Brush. Okay, I think that's good. So we're going to use our Lex Brush for this, this one as well. Share right, that's great. The bugger. So, I'm going to be moving the burger. Let's increase the size. Okay, 110 is okay. So we're going to be shifting our burger a little bit down. No. Oh, let's reduce these sizes. Let's reduce these sizes. Let's reduce this to 90. Let's reduce this to fifty five or fifty. So that's great. So we have enough space for other designs. So the next thing we're going to be drawing is shape. Click on plus icon. Go to elements. Click on this shape. This. So. Want to write limited offer? So we're going to be changing the color to red. Text Limited Offer. Alright, let 
let's look for a font let's use open sans okay let's change the color to white reduce the size let's use 35 okay okay cool so the next thing is to draw the shape of order now click on this so I want to change the color to let's see if you can use gradients let's come to this color okay let's just use the background color not changing the low light okay all right it's changed so let's copy this limited alpha again can use it to all right order now Order now. It seems the font have changed. We use a persons. So let's make it bold. Let's reduce the size. The size is big. Let's use twenty. Okay, so what next is to put the burger flag on the website. Edit. www.burger.com Burger. Dot com so we can reduce this size let's use 18 
so let's copy this again duplicate so we copy this again move it here and edit it to call for delivery for delivery okay let's make this bold let's copy edit zero nine zero six nine three two four five zero seven so going to increase this size both first increase this size let's use twenty Let's use 30. So that's that. Let's make this bolder. Let's reduce the size. Seventeen. So that's that. So the next thing is to put the twenty percent discount. Change the font to white. Discount edit. Discount. Discounts. Let's reduce the size a little bit. I use twenty twenty-eight. Okay, let's use twenty-six. You can use nudge to move it. So copy again, duplicate, 20%, percent, okay, make it bold, bold, Increase the size. Forty two. All right, that's that. So let's nudge this up. So I think that's that on our flyer design. So the next thing to do is to save your design by clicking on this place.
click on it click on download so just leave the suggested file type click download so prepare your design so once it's done so i mean your design is downloaded you got your design so let's check our download is not yet there let's download again download download okay it's not downloading now as you can see this is our design from canva i hope you enjoyed the video